There is, in essence, no downside compared to the Octria scan. Uh, the only downside is going to be cost, and that would be the imaging studies that would be cheaper would be like a CT, uh, might be cheaper than a Dota Tape PET. Octria scan itself is actually quite expensive, so that wouldn't be a downside to that. Uh, the benefits are numerous. So if you take an Octria scan, an Octria scan from a patient perspective takes at a minimum two days and maybe three to four days to perform because the patient comes back over time, whereas a somatostatin receptor PET imaging study, usually you inject, you image them one hour later, and you're done. So the patient convenience is markedly improved with a somatostatin receptor PET compared to other conventional imaging uh, or Octria scans that we would have done previously. There's also decreased dose, higher sensitivity, higher specificity, the ability to quantitate uptake, which will be important, obviously, as we move forward to a Theranostics approach. Uh, so in essence, it's no one should ever order an Octria scan again.